Delighted to be joined by Managing Director of Goffs UK, Tim Kent and Derek O'Connor. How are things, lads? Good, yeah, we've had, a, we've had a great morning, halfway through it. Got a few more people to see, but it, it's beautiful here in Wexford. So having Tell us a around. little bit what you're doing today, Tim. So, um, we, in my, my new role, like the Point of Point guys, and this is the heart of it down here in Wexford, they're, they're a huge part of our business, and um, you know, both, both the store trade and, and reselling them as, as, uh, as Point of Pointers, as, as winning horses, hopefully winning horses. Um, so it's a good, good chance to get down here and see them, see the area, see what they do, and it's great to, to see the different systems and see how they work and... and and meet the lads at home really so we're here at the, at the Doyles here and uh, and yeah we've had a good morning I've even sat on one or two so they must have found a safe one for me but uh, no it's great get down here with Derek and we've we've had the January sale just gone which went really well broke a, broke a record um, which, which is a great start to the year and we've got the entry sale coming up in at the beginning of April so the idea is just to, to, to meet the lads and understand what's going on and look forward to to the en entry and spring sales later on in the year. And Derek, you're associated with Goffs. Tell people a little bit about what your role is and what you do for Goffs. Yeah, David, I asked, yeah, my role is, is quite simple, to be honest. I, I work as a, an agent, so I'm an Irish agent for the Goffs group. And uh, to be honest, it, it's, it's a very, very pleasurable job. Uh, I suppose I, I liaise between the trainers, the owners, and the sales company, and I try and encourage them to come to our sales. So it's, uh, I'm dealing with people I'm dealing with every day anyhow, you know. So I'm talking to the likes of Dials here, Colin Ball, Dennis Murphy, multitude of trainers all over the country so it's, it's, it's quite easy to deal with them all and uh, it's, it's quite a simple job to be honest yeah and you'll be riding a lot of these horses on sundays and four-year-olds and, and you win on quite a lot of them that go back to the golf sales yeah yeah so that's that's very important for me to have a an angle on form and uh, i'm able to help the customers on sales day and i'm able to talk about form and particular race and courses and give them a little bit of an insight into what what it takes to win an Irish point of point. And as we know, it's very difficult to win an Irish point of point. The, the standard is exceptionally high at the moment and uh, it appears to be getting stronger all the time. Like, the, the amount of great winners that we're producing in, in Irish point of points daily is incredible. Like, and uh, So it, to, to promote an Irish point of point, as I say, is, is not a difficult thing to do at the moment because the, the way the, the, the race records are just constantly churning out good horses. So um, no, it's, a very, it's a very pleasurable job and uh, as I say, it's liaising between the, the owners, the trainers and the sales companies and the prospective buyers. And things are going well for you this season in terms of riding wise. You're riding plenty of winners as always. Yeah. Uh, you were unlucky at the start of the season with a couple of falls that kept you out for a couple of weeks, but um, yeah. Yeah. things are going well for you on the track and point to points. No, actually, the falls haven't, David. You know, so I never dwell on them. Uh, we've had a great season. Uh, you know, we've had uh, some very nice horses to ride. We've had some lovely track horses to ride. We've had a couple of very pleasurable spins to England there uh, the last two Saturdays. So. Okay, Corral was a great yeah, day for you. Yeah, yeah, he usually gave me a great ride and uh, it was a listed chase in, in Warwick and uh, that's, that's very pleasurable to ride for Mr McManus and Mickey Henderson so that, that's the highlight of my year so far so come here, hopefully it will continue and uh, we'll keep our fingers crossed. And Tim, Derek, as what he mentioned there, he's a massive asset to Goffs. Oh, he's a huge asset. Yeah, I mean, he, there's no better person really to, to understand exactly what's going on in, in, the, in the point of point world. And as he, as he just said there, it's part of what he's doing anyway. So it's, it's it, ho hopefully what he's doing with the riding and the sales, the, the two marry him really well. And he's able to, to certainly advise us on what we should and shouldn't be doing in, in, in terms of, of getting the horses to the sales. So yeah, it's, it's, it's worked really well so far and a long way at last. And after, when, after the next few months then when all these four rows have ran and they're all sold on then it goes back to the Land Rover and it all starts again then yeah so obviously it's the spring sales in Donkster and then the Land Rover sales so you know these, these lads have a, the point of point trainers here they have a bit of a break clean up clean up what's gone on here and then and then go again so uh, yeah we, the, the, uh, it'll be the sale in Donkster in May and then the Land Rover in June and we're already already looking at uh, at store horses for those two horses for those two sales sorry so that comes around really quickly and uh, yeah we'll be out in the farms the team, teams will be out in the farms the inspection teams looking at horses for, the, for those two sales and you know the cycle continues but it's it's great fun the dreams are very much still alive at this time so long way at last good well listen it's nice to meet you Tim. Thank you. Thank best you. of luck in your new role with Thank Goss as managing director and Derek best luck for the rest of the season Thank thanks you. very much